Configuring a Cintiq Pro in Windows is easy. Once the Cintiq Pro drivers have been installed, place the display in an ergonomically comfortable location. Most people prefer the Cintiq Pro be in front of whichever hand they use for writing or drawing, and the keyboard under their non-dominant hand. For left-handed users, the Cintiq Pro would be on the left side of the laptop or to the left of the keyboard if it's connected to a desktop computer. Default display settings may need to be adjusted for the setup. To change display settings to match this configuration, right-click on the desktop and choose Display Settings. If the displays are duplicated, the screens will match. Otherwise, the setting window will likely be on the original display. Duplicating displays is easiest when getting started, but is not the best use of multiple monitors. To arrange the displays to match their physical orientation, select Extend These Displays from the Multiple Displays drop-down menu. Then identify which is which by selecting Identify under the numbered display icons. A number will appear identifying each monitor by number. If the arrangement in display settings does not match the physical orientation, drag the monitor's icon to the correct location, whether left, right, above, or below the other display. Then click Apply. Now, when using any other pointing device, like a mouse or trackpad, the cursor will move from screen to screen intuitively. Since the pen only works on the Cintiq Pro, Display Toggle is a very useful setting for an Express Key on the optional Express Key Remote, or for one of the pen's switch settings. It enables easy navigation of the entire desktop, using only the pen. To set a pen switch to Display Toggle, open Wacom Desktop Center and choose Pen Settings. With the pen selected in the Tools list, choose Display Toggle from the drop-down menu for either end of the pen switch. Pressing this switch will now map the pen to the entire desktop until it's pressed again. To have it only map to the Cintiq Pro or the other display, independent of one another, select Functions in the Tools list and choose the second option, Pen Display to Other Displays. Now it will map to one display or the other, but not across both.